Yo guys, what's going on? Welcome back to another video. Bruv, I haven't... My posting is so not consistent and I'm sorry about that. I've just been so caught up with college work. The assignments, they've just been smacking me in the face with it. I've been managing basically college and work together and it's just been really hard to put videos out. I have been posting on TikTok but YouTube is just... I don't know man, it's just I get so tired and so lazy and I just, ah, I don't know. It's just, I'm very sorry guys, but I'm gonna try my best. I'm on half term right now, Christmas half term, and I'm gonna try and get some videos out. And obviously next half term, I'll probably do some more, but summer, we'll, we'll get to that part anyway. But today we are doing a video where I'm gonna be talking about my 2020, how 2020 went for me. So the pros and cons of this year, uh, I've only made a short list. It's not like too many things that happened to me this year, if I'm being honest. Um, if I sound a bit weird, sorry, I'm a bit ill right now. Don't worry, it's not the Rona. Man's good, man's been avoiding that shit, you know. My man's been wearing masks, antibacterial, and then man, there, you know, though. Before we get into the video, I want you guys to go down there, smash that like button. Let's try to get this to 15 likes, you know, that ones 15, not like a standard target. Can we get this for 15 likes? Make sure to go down there, smash that subscribe button. We're trying to get a channel to 200 subscribers. It was supposed to be by the end of the year, but uh, yeah, your boy hasn't been posting, so uh, I don't blame you, man. Make sure to go and follow my socials, they'll be on the screen. So follow my Twitter and my Instagram. As well as that, go follow me on TikTok as well. It's gonna be at Talax, it's at under my name. Uh, I'll be getting, I'll be talking about TikTok as well, like later in another video, but yeah, we'll, we'll just get into the 2020 bit right now. Let's start with the cons. So I got, I just wrote it down on my phone, I'm just gonna look at it. So, let's be honest, <laughs> the biggest mess up of this year is COVID. Like, COVID has messed up so many of my plans, my mates' plans, everyone's plans. Uh, it's not just me that's been affected by COVID, it's many people. Like, I've, you know, it, it's, it's been, a, it's been a tough year for everyone, let's just be honest, but i've found i've seen a lot of people cope with it in a very very good way um one of my biggest inspirations being like ksi right he's been posting videos at home he's obviously got more, a lot more time on his hands like, chilling at home so he's posting very like he's posting very like creative videos doing red and all that kind of stuff you know i've seen other content creators do stuff in their own house um even when lockdown was up they just got out and posted as many videos as they can before obviously lockdown screws us over again um, talking about lockdowns, we're on tier 4 You know, remember when Boris mentioned uh, a tier 3 A 3 tier system for the UK And then tier 4 What? <laughs> How does that make sense? How is he introducing a 3 tier system And then slapping on another tier like but by the end of by the end of like 20, 2055 we're gonna be on t167 like what well, one what's actually happening to this world not even just this world what's happening to the uk bruv we were doing so well we cleared uh numbers were going down drastically we even got more tests out and somehow we're still back in lockdown how did how does that happen like how like i can't even like covid has affected me so much like covid has actually fucked me over so much like not as in like like you know health wise that hasn't affected me yet like thank god for that but i mean like not mentally either i guess like i've been coping very well like at home but the main thing is like the videos like i've had a lot of uh plans to make videos like i had a lot of public video ideas i had a lot of um video ideas that i could do with my mates you know go to their house record and stuff like that you know do some new collaborations and stuff and it's just it's just not been working out and i know that's not an excuse to like not post but it's also very like it's not very encouraging to me it's not very motivating to me like to know that i like i like recording videos with my mates like, i love recording like if you see me recording videos with my mates i have a lot more fun that's just because i get along with them you know i can get their banter in the videos it's just so much more of a better vibe and i couldn't get much of that this year and that has really put me down but i'm hoping for next year that you know that changes and i can actually improve on that um but we'll talk about like 2021 in another video I'll people this is my 2020 video the next video will be like how i'm trying to be in 2021 so we'll get to that a lot after but don't worry about that now We'll just stick, we'll stick with 2020, you know. Just let's just worry about this shit year, and then we'll focus on you know, the next year. Because at this point, I don't even know how 2021 is going to be. Probably like COVID 20 is going to come out. Updated features, bruv. Like symptoms be like, yo, there's uh, particles of bacteria flying around. Like, bruv, can't be asked. It's long. But yeah, my next con would be um, I couldn't see my friends in in person as much. I couldn't go out and I couldn't go see. Not even just like go out and like have fun. I couldn't even just see them as much. I've just been 
FaceTiming them. I've seen them a couple of times, but not as much as I did like the year before that. It's just been a lot tougher and this also relates back to COVID, you know, with the lockdowns and the restrictions. It's just really prohibited my social skills in a way. Like I still like kept kept in contact with a lot of people, like, you know, over the phone, over text. I, I still talk to everyone, but it's just, that there's nothing that compares to like physical interaction. Let's just be honest, nothing compares to physical interaction. So yeah, that's just, that's just another bad thing. But we're gonna go to the pros and then let's just get that discussed. So um, some of the pros that I would say is I got a lot, even though I didn't focus on YouTube as much, YouTube is a lot harder to do than TikTok. TikTok is so much easier to do and it's just, I get to connect with a lot more people. So I've been focusing a lot of my energy on TikTok. That is my recap of my 2020. I've posted around, let me check the thing actually. Let me check the picture. So I have posted, I've posted 168 videos on TikTok. That is mad. Like obviously they're like short videos. Some of them are like a minute long. You know, some of them took a bit longer than others, but 168 videos, know 750k views that is mind blowing to me 750k views for this year that is crazy you know not, almost 100k likes like that is oh my i just can't believe I'm, I'm so grateful for like the people that stick with my tiktok and you know watch my videos and so on so you know it's been a crazy year but i managed to spend although i didn't transition youtube well i did make good use of my tiktok you know I'm, i grew that platform i've been trying to post as much as i can and still entertain the people that still keep up with my videos you know, i'm not going to stop entertaining that's just that's my thing in it i'm not going to stop entertaining that's I'm, that's always going to be a part of my life another thing another pro i would say is that i got to focus a lot more on myself you know i got to build my confidence with like a lot of people like before i used to be like a very very introverted but nowadays like i started talking to a lot more people on tiktok like i started popping up to more people i've also like got in contact with a lot, a lot of creators and you know talk to them talk about their experiences how covid has affected them you know maybe a couple collaborations and stuff like that in the talks but you know at the end of the day it's like it's more about like connecting with a lot more people you know even though i can't connect with people in person i can always do it online that's one thing i like about like the space of tiktok and online and social media is that i can connect to a lot of people that i got to do a lot of things this year that involved content creating and i just kind of built I, be, I feel like I've built a good audience, I've connected with a lot more people, I've met a lot of new people that are interested in the stuff that I do, you know, are interested in working with me as well. So, you know, you'll probably see a few more collaborations soon, but for now, I'm just trying to like, like, what's the word I'm looking for? Like, kind of find my, you know how like musicians find their sound? Like, that's kind of like what I'm trying to do about with content creating. Like, I'm trying to find the style, the content creating style. Um, like, I'm still working on it every day, like, you know, whenever... I, get an idea i write it down like on my notes it's just full of ideas but i just don't execute them um but yeah i'll definitely be working on them a lot more um and a lot and another pro i would say is that i got to enjoy my own company a lot more like i've been chilling a lot at home playing a lot of games with my mates uh just creating tiktoks in my room literally like if you look at my content literally it's all it's always this background because it's just in my room like in the space of this small room i just create everything i need um it's it is difficult because obviously you know i don't have the biggest room in the world you know it's hard to move around and make content all that kind of stuff but i try to manage as much as i can you know it's it's not the best thing to do with but yeah i've enjoyed a lot of my own company like before i always wanted to be with people but ever since corona shit came around you know obviously lockdown you have to spend time at home not go out because of all that stuff i've just kind of gotten used to just being on my own kind of doing stuff by myself so like i guess it's a good way because I'm kind of learning to work on my own instead of, you know, trying to rely on others kind of thing. Um, I still connect with my mates, you know, over gaming and social media. So, but obviously it's, it's a lot different to that in person. But I feel like I've, I've, it's a good thing working on like, you know, like enjoying your own company purely because, well, for example, when you start living on your own and stuff like that, you need to learn to like cope by yourself. But yeah, I guess overall 2020, like it's been a really shit year. It's been really shit. I feel like it's been more negative than positive, but I feel like I've improved as a person a lot over the year. Um, you know, I've been through a lot of hardship and stuff like that. I'm pretty sure everyone has, you know, I'm not just saying it like I'm the only one that went through it. Of course, everyone has, but I'm definitely hoping that next year is a lot better uh, for everyone else and for myself. You know, I, I really want to like improve and just take my content creating to like the next level. Um, I hope, I'm hoping that 
you know the covid eases up and then it starts clearing up a little bit and i can actually start going out and making more banging content for you guys uh but one thing i would i would say is you guys are my viewers if you guys have any ideas that you would want me to do during lockdown obviously lockdown is a bit of a tough period but if you guys want to see any kind of videos make sure to go down there list them down below in the comment section or my socials will be in the description hit me up on one of them on my twitter instagram I think my Snapchat is there as well. If you want to add me there, add me and then just just give me some ideas that you guys would like to see me do. Um, obviously, I'm going to be doing videos with my mum as well, so that will be coming up soon. But yeah, like I'm going to be trying my absolute best to try and make this work. Um, I, I've been slacking a lot, but I've had all, I've also had a lot on my plate. So you know, I feel like I need to like start putting in more work. I guess that's the word I'm looking for. Start putting in more work and try to get as much videos as I can out as possible. Uh, but yeah, that's definitely the thing. So if you guys have any ideas that you would like to see me do on my channel, make sure to go down there, list them below. But yeah, without further ado, I guess that's the end of that video. My next video, I'm not too sure which one it will be. It will be either the video with my mum or it will be about the goals of 2021. So just keep an eye out for that. Um, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I know I rambled on a lot in this video, but this is more me talking to you guys than me kind of entertaining you guys. This is one of the talks where like I just want to get stuff off my chest and just get, you know, just tell you people what is on my mind and what I'm looking forward to kind of thing. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure to go down there, smash that like button. Let's try to get this to 15 likes. Uh, go down there, subscribe as well. You know, follow my socials. Keep up to date with all my stuff, you know, follow my TikTok because I'll definitely be posting a lot more videos on that as well. And yeah, I guess I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.